Hi viewers, today my video is on the assembly of card AC compressor. Viewers, you can see it's all parts that I have disassembled and cleaned with gasoline. Another thing that I tell you that this compressor is working with R134 gas and it's have 5 pistons. You can see here. Now I can tell you the stepwise procedure of its assembly. Now let's go. Uh, now first step is uh, and the fitting of lips here in the front body of the compressor. You can see this is the front end of the compressor and uh, this is the lip seal. And uh, this is a groove uh, inside the body and uh, this seal is fitted inside this groove. First uh, you uh, you all link all the ports and lip seal of the surface and uh, select a ratchet and that is nearly outside of the diameter and this will not harm your seal and smoothly settle with the hammering light hammering on it before fitting of this seal put some oil there inside the groove and the outside of the seal the oil that i have used in this compressor is andiat oil this oil is uh, mainly used with r134 gases mostly compressor mentioned the specific oil in the back side of the compressor now I have placed the uh, lip seal inside the groove of the body and the second step is uh, fitting of needle bearings inside the two uh, main bodies of the compressor. This, uh, this is uh, uh, the main body of the compressor and that uh, these bearings hold the uh, swash plate rod. Now viewers next step is placing thrust bearing on the both end of swash blade this one and this one this is thrust bearing you can see here now the next step is placing all this five piston on this swash blade each piston have two semi sphere ball bearings currently viewers duplicate all these ball bearing so it will stick uh, in the sitting area and you will place in this direction i will show you after all this placement on the swash blade now viewers you can see here i have placed all these five piston on the swash blade and the next step is placing these piston in the body of the compressor viewers you can see these are the main body parts of the compressor in which uh, these piston and swash blade are placed and these are two double pins installed in the both end of the bodies this will reduce the measurement during fit up viewers you can see here i have placed all these five piston in one side of the compressor and when I rotate the shaft, all five piston moving in to and fro positions. Now viewers place this gasket and join this, these two parts uh, and these two double pins will help out to reduce the misalignment. Now viewers the next step is placing these wall plates on the both end of the compressor. Uh, viewers you can see here the manufacturer stamped F on this plate and R on this plate. The F uh, shown uh, is the front side and R will indicate the back side of the compressor. And, and both uh, plates uh, consist of four parts. This uh, wall and this wall plate and this gasket and this one also a gasket. And this is for combination of one side and the other side also have four combinations and you can see this is discharge plate and 
this is one is suction blade and this is these are both gaskets now I will and this double pin and you can see these are both double pins and this will help out to uh, align all these uh, gaskets uh, and uh, wall plates on their exact locations now viewers you can see here I have placed all these wall plates and gasket and this is gasket and the small one is wall blade and the other side outside is gasket and the inner side of the plate is a wall plate now I have placed both these wall plates with the help of double pins on the both ends now the last step is placing the cover on both sides of the compressor now viewers you can see here I have done all this assembly and except it's a clutch part and this will show you in my next video with also gas charging procedure in the last uh, I will take a compression test on it by placing a thumb on the discharge board and make 3 to 4 turns this will make a pop up sound same goes with a uh, discharge port this will also making a pop up sound now new viewers uh, this will ensure that uh, all pistons making enough uh, pressure in the chamber and uh, this will a positive sign for me now in my next video i will assemble in my car and the proper gas charging procedure now viewers don't forget to subscribe my channel and thank you for watching my videos and stay blessed